What's going on, y'all? It's your boy Young Lee Jr. here. So unfortunate, another loss. Um, <laughs> three and eight again. Um, it's this. Uh, you know, Justin Herbert had a good performance. I believe he threw like thirty-seven fifty-one attempts, three hundred sixteen yards, one touchdown, uh, one interception. I believe. Man, just uh, we just underperformed, man. Twenty-seven seventeen, uh, defense was all right, you know, but we still was unable to execute on offense. So it's the same old, you know, BS, same old stuff going on right now. So, um, I think it may need to be a change with Anthony Lynn. Just just finish the season with him and see if we can go and move forward in the off season. Um, you know, Dean Sperano's man, you gotta really change the culture and just bring this team back into the right direction because right now, uh. <laughs> We out of the playoff contentions and, you know, just can't even win a divisional game at this point. It's not even, it's not even like breaking my heart. It's just, you get so numb to it and you expect low, you have low expectations with a team that's just continuously underperforming each and every single week. So it's really pretty much nothing you can really do at this point. <laughs> just, you know, just continuously to be a loyal fan. You know what I'm saying? So, I mean, look, dog, like. I'm trying to put my hopes and dreams. Maybe we could be one day number one, you know. Uh, thank you to Smitty, man, you know what I'm saying? You know, <laughs> you know, for the culture, man, you know, we're going to be number one one day. We ain't going to suck forever, man. You know, we got a good quarterback. Just build around him. We three and eight, man. Um, hey, just suck it up. <laughs> so, I mean, that's really all I can really say, man. I mean, it, horrible. I, it was good to see Austin Eckler back on the field. Uh, really good. Mike Williams at yeah, three session, 26 yards on uh, Jalen Guyton was good. Um, Josh Kelly, he's doing all right. He had a one, I think one touchdown uh, score uh, for two, you know, it was like a two yard touchdown score. So I think that was good, man. I uh, so we can get us back in the ball game before half. But overall, this team continuously underperforming and um, just it's just sad each and every single week. So you look at the schedule, who we go against next week. But, you know, <sighs> Just, just lost words right now, man. But uh, Herbert's the only one that's keeping keeping us alive. Some people uh, believe. I think uh, L.A. He mentioned you might as well just put in Tyrod, so we don't have to pretty much uh, risk Justin Herbert getting injured because it's it's nothing to play for right now. <laughs> we know, so I kind of agree with home on that, man. But it is what it is, man. Experts are right. So will we ever be number one? I don't know. At this point, but um, that's my analysis on this, man. Jo uh, Josh Allen, uh, congratulations to the Bills, man. Bills fans, Josh Allen did his thing on here. Uh, we did, we did actually. I said the defense actually did have some come up some um, turnovers, had some fumbles, but we was unable to execute on offense, man. It's just like, dang, bro, like, so we gotta balance this out, man. But it is what it is, man. You know, uh, we made it very difficult. Uh, I think Josh Allen had like a big hit, man. Almost rolled his ankle, but he still managed to get back up and play the game. I was like, bro, like Joey Bosa's a freaking beast, man. So, but uh, O line, that's what we need. We try to get a quarterback sneak in the last play. You see how that felt. So, <laughs> it is what it is, man. So, thank you, G Mo Dog, LA, man. Shout out to y'all and other Chargers fans. Let's go on to next week, man. See if they're going to disappoint us again. But um, let's get ready for next season and look forward to the draft. That's all I got to say. I'm out. Deuces.